What's good, y'all? It's your boy Little Roy, aka Little Roy TV. We back with another video. Now, first and foremost, I just do want to say thank you for tuning in for this video. For the people that's been here, for the people that's new, what's up? Um, subscribe to this channel. Also, subscribe to my music channel. Um, as well as go follow me and support me on Instagram. All those links will be down below in the description. As well as my Instagram will be on the screen. So, you see the title. You see the thumbnail. We're here to talk about something that's kind of flying under the radar. But not over here on this channel. So, if you're new, subscribe to this channel my other channel. And keep rocking with me and stay tuned. We're about to get into the video of Must Cop or Not. Of the Air Jordan 2 Women's Low. Air Jordan 2 Lows women's unc to chicago so let's get right to it and you'll hear if i have to say they're a must cop or not so let's get it Whew. all right so off rip i do want to say now this shoe is kind of a little bit driving me crazy only because first off for resale they're already under retail i believe probably make a couple like a little lunch money um, retail for these are saying 150 because they're jordan low too so 150 for the twos and it's a low. And it's set to come out next week, March 8th, which I don't know what date that is, March 8th. Um, that's a Wednesday, uh, like two weeks from now, week and a half. So yeah, they come out. And now I just think, I'm a, like I said, I'm a sucker for red and a sucker for baby blue, UNC blue. And to me, these Chicago to, I mean, the UNC to Chicago, to me, this looks so fire. Like, to me, this shoe is so, like, it makes sense why it's a women's exclusive. Because, yes, it's, like, a cute shoe. Um, I want these, but it's, like, God. Jordan already dropped the whole, not the whole collection, but a lot of sneakers that's coming out. For the holiday or the spring collection or whatever collection you decide to drop. And you have to be very picky with money. Like, I'm already starting to buy outfits. And I have, I checked last year. Last year, I bought a lot of stuff, obviously, for resale. But when I looked at my collection of how much personals I bought last year, I bought eight personals last year. And you guys know, once it comes to the fit, I mean, the sneakers, it becomes a fit. Sneakers are already expensive. Obviously, I get mine for retail, but... Then getting outfits, that's also expensive, is crazy. So it's like, you gotta be very picky on what shoes you really want. Especially because, you know, if you wanna get 10 pairs, you better figure out how you can get 10. That's, think about it, just put an estimate. Most sneakers are like 200, right? Do 200 times 5, that's 1,000 already. And then if you want 10, that's 2,000. So you're essentially spending $2,000 automatically on the side of just sneakers. So what about the outfits? To me, this sneaker is going to hurt me because I think when I thought I'm going to add twos to my collection, this would be a perfect two to add to my collection. One, they're not going for nothing on resale. They're not going for crazy hype. So first and foremost, let's just say it's a must cop for me, but I'm not going to cop these for personal. I think I made up my decision as much as I want to so badly. To me, this is just fire. Even though it's so like basic if you look at the top it's just red and white i just think the fact that it's a jordan 2 i think twos look way better when it's a jordan 2 low rather than the high when it's bulky that's why i have no twos in my collection but the fact is that it's unc blue in the back and then wrapped around red and white to me it is a fire shoe like i really would want this for my personal collection it'll be something different it's type q is fire but I think I made up my decision. Well, I already been looking at the pictures. <sighs> Shit's gonna hurt, but I think I'm not gonna cop these for the toe. Obviously, I'm gonna see them in the uh, in the mall in the stores when I go see them. It's gonna hurt that I'm not buying this for the toe. It's women's exclusive, so I think they're only going up to a men's ten and a half, which is a twelve W. Right now, like I said, resale is going roughly for two hundred to two twenty, two thirty ish. So you could probably make lunch money on this shoe. Obviously, if it's that low now, by the time it drops next week, price is going to go down. Um, this shoe will be sitting in stores, and I'm pretty sure a lot of girls 
are gonna think the same way I'm thinking that it's a cute colorway. So they're gonna cop. But to me, I'm gonna have to pass on these, man. As much as I would, don't want to, I gotta be very picky on my choices with my money this year. Um, a lot of things happen that, you know, I can't just be splurging a whole bunch of money for no reason. But damn, to me, these are fire. It's underrated. Obviously, I can't wait till they drop so I can at least see them in the stores. And then, you know, who knows? Maybe I change my mind. Maybe not. But damn, these are fire to me. So for personal, cop these shoes. If you want them for re re resale, then you could do that too. We all know twos is not a big popular silhouette so definitely these are going to be breaking it's breaking already right now unless you've got customers or you could sell it quick fast the day of or whatever you could probably make some money but right now if you look at the sizes from like i said they all go roughly 200 plus so from 7w all the way to 12w is like two they all the same prices essentially it doesn't matter if it's like 10 20 dollars off it's the same shit but um damn man I really want these for the toe, but I'm going to have to pass. Because realistically, when am I going to wear these? And what outfit would I want to get with this? You get what I'm saying? Like, it just, I think these are the shoes that I like. It looks nice. Like, it's a cop. But I'm just going to have to pass on them. So, for me, it's going to hurt. If anybody you out there want to buy some shoes off of me and give me extra $200 to buy these, then hit me up. <laughs> And maybe I won't feel bad because you guys can help me buy these shoes. So let me know what you guys want to buy so I can get some money. And then also buy these. So I don't have to come out of pocket. I won't have to feel guilty. But anyways, I'm just joking with that. Um, Yeah, so this is the must cop or not for the Jordan 2 Lowe's USC to Chicago women's. Let me know down below if this is an underrated sneaker. Do you agree with me that this is a sleeper? shoe that no one's paying attention to um are you gonna cop when it drops to rub it in my face or are you gonna pass and skip because you being picky and choosy you know choosing you know wisely this year with sneakers let me know all that in the comments below i'm gonna obviously read them and um yeah i'll see you guys in the next video remember go follow me on instagram and show some support over there check my music channel subscribe to this channel i'll see you guys in the next video Peace.